All right, this is Mr. Barr and Mrs. Buck Masters in the room right now, so this might not be as crazy as some of the other videos. Let's see if we can see her. Let's see. Can we do this? Can we go find her over there somewhere? Is she over there? Where is she? Is she over there? Is she there? Probably will this thing turn? Where? Ah, there she is! Yay! All right. And I'm going to talk about finding the measures of different angles, things like that, as soon as I bring this all back together. All right about, about there? How about that? OK. So finding the measures of complementary, supplementary, vertical, and adjacent angles. We talked about those in the last video. So let's do a quick review. Complementary angles. So here are some complements. It's two angles that add up to 90 degrees. So here are two angles, and if that's angle A and this is angle B, they add up to 90 degrees. So complementaries add up to 90 degrees. Supplementary angles, here's a picture. Supplementary angles add up to 180 degrees. Vertical angles, these are the guys that are vertical to each other and they're congruent, so that means they have the same measurement. So there's an example of some vertical angles. So here's angle A and angle B, those guys are vertical to each other and they have the same measurement. Vertical angles have the same measurement. And adjacent angles are angles that share a side. So A and B, those guys share this side right here. They share a side. Okay, let's do some problems. New color. What is the value of angle F? Now, it's kind of hard to see, but right here we have that little kind of square. What does that square tell us? It tells us that this is a right angle. So together, this whole angle is 90 degrees. Well, if this angle right here is 30 degrees, and this is an unknown X, 30 degrees plus what is going to add up to 90 degrees? 30 plus 50, 30 plus 60, 30 plus 100, 30 plus what? Well, 30 plus 60 would give us our 90 degrees. So this is going to be 60 degrees. The measure of an angle is 161 degrees. What is the measure of it's supplementary angle. Well, I know that supplements have to add up to 180 degrees. So 161 degrees plus what is going to be 180 degrees? If I add 10 to it, I'm up to 171. And if I add another 9, I'm up to 180. So I think it's 19 degrees. 19 degrees. What is the value of D? Here's D right there. Well, its vertical angle is 65 degrees, so D is also 65 degrees because D is vertical to the other side. That's 65 degrees. And one final one.
what is the value of z? What is the value of this angle right here? Well, I know the entire angle is 66. And this little angle right here, this adjacent angle, is 26. So it's 26 plus something equals 66. 26 plus something is 66. Now I could do a little algebra here. Solve it. x equals 40. Does that work? 40 plus 26 equals 66. Does that work? 40 plus 20. Yep, that works. So our answer is 40 degrees. Remember, these are what, adjacent angles. All right, that's it. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.